Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, then hello. Welcome, my name's Sorrel, and in today's video, I have a little chit chat, get ready with me for a night out. So this is the makeup I've done. Also, sorry about the setup situation. If you watch the video, you'll find out why. So before we get into the video, make sure you're subscribed to my channel if you haven't already. Yeah, without any further ado, let's get into it. <laughs> Why? So obviously guys, as you can see, I'm back at uni. This is my new uni room. Um, it's very, very small. So this is probably gonna have to be like my new kind of filming area, filming space, filming background. I do have lights behind me, which I haven't turned on yet. I really don't like my hair, but like I've already curled it. So I don't wanna like ruin it. See my problem, such a dilemma. So basically guys, I did something really, really, really stupid. So, a couple of videos ago, my Primark one, um, I took, so I normally keep the bit that attaches, I'm going to do my eyelids, I normally keep the bit that attaches your camera to a tripod on my camera, just so I don't have to swivel it off all the time, and like twist it back on if that makes sense. Um, I took it off, and obviously like completely forgot, hadn't filmed since that Primark video, um, went to pack my stuff up for uni, and went to film the other day and realised I'd forgotten it but I was like this isn't freaking working where's my brush so you're literally on two, like four notebooks right now and I've got the camera cap and like the camera sorry about my tan as well I need to wash this bit off um the camera strap like bal balancing you up but yeah it's all good I'm gonna get it this weekend when I go home if I can find it hopefully it'll be there if not I'm just gonna have to like either get a new tripod or get a new attachment Today guys is October 3rd so I'm going out with all my cheer girls on a social as it's Wednesday and tonight is Mean Girls theme so you know we've got to do a pink eye. Great. This is vodka lemonade by the way. If you drink vodka coke you're actually a weirdo. I used to always drink it and I unless I'm drunk like I actually cannot drink it now I just find it so disgusting I'm using my Lick and Lash 35E and my Huda Beauty for the pinks I'm literally just packing this onto my crease because I really want it to be pigmented also I didn't set my eyes it's just so much better not setting your eyes honestly guys do not be scared to not set your eyes like I said I'm back at uni and the amount of work like I already have is not fun it is not fun at all i did say obviously like when i came to uni i was gonna like continue uploading every week and stuff and obviously i haven't i think this is like the third well this weekend hopefully this will go up this weekend so it's been like two weeks without an upload apart from the workload uni's good i'm going home tomorrow because i actually have thursdays and fridays off um i think i just about to go home on, on hopefully i'm not too hungover like i'm not actually gonna be mad tonight because my train's at one so I don't want to be like really really hungover because I honestly feel like absolute death when I'm hung when I'm hungover and like I don't want to do anything. What series have people been watching recently? Um Jed and I on the weekend started the bodyguard, bodyguard, the bodyguard, I don't know what it's actually called, and I am literally obsessed. Um we're on the third episode, we're gonna finish it finish watching it this weekend, but it's so good. It's a BBC documentary. Um documentary series um and there's one series at the moment if you haven't watched it like i honestly recommend it so much it's so good like everyone like every loads of people have been talking about it so you probably have already watched it or you probably know what i'm talking about guys big mouth is out this weekend big mouth season two if you haven't watched big mouth you need to watch it me and jed watched it in down we just like kind of put it on like in the background there's like something there and then we actually like, because one of my friends, flat, my flat, well, I just looked up like and actually blinded. Did we watch, re watch our whole series? We kind of, I think we did because we weren't really watching it in Amsterdam. Um, we were just watching it like bits here and there because it was while I was getting ready as well. I'm going to take Manny from the Huda Beauty palette to deepen up the crease. I saw the trailer for it and it actually, like, I'm actually 
like so excited to watch it i literally cannot wait we've got so much to watch this weekend we've got big mouth season two we've got the bodyguard um x factor who's been watching x factor i have um i don't really know how i feel about it this year like obviously like i think this year like it's a very very strong year there's a lot of good people but like there's no one i'm like i love you kind of thing um but obviously that might change like we're still at the beginning i did actually really like the boy that sang boy man that sang the breaking free from high school musical and it's actually amazing that was really good also i really like that man um he's really cute he kind of like has like the squeaky voice um and he sang whitney houston he is amazing and i think he's really cute as well like not in that way so i'm just gonna go cut my crease but i'm gonna do this on off camera so i'll be back in a second has anyone been watching the shane dawson series on jake paul um i haven't watched a third one yet because me and jed started it again together so i've got to wait to watch it with him this weekend which i don't really mind um but yeah mm -hmm. logan paul did a little video reply like in response to shane dawson and i haven't watched it but i saw it on twitter and i think he basically said like how Shane is scaring children and the quote he was basically like how like Logan like laughed like seeing a dead body and how he like pretended um that he got shot in front of his fans and I never knew he did that until I saw it in the Shane Dawson video and I was literally like what the fuck like what the hell that is like really really weird and yeah I was just like reading tweets and like to see what people's opinions people were like saying how they don't actually think like jake paul is a sociopath and how they think logan paul is one but jake's trying jake's always i don't know i can't what they well, i know what they're saying but i don't know how to explain it they were saying like how they think that jake's always just been like in the shadow of his older brother so he's kind of having to like compete that is even bloody weirder i'm sorry if any of you like jake or logan paul but no, no, there's a no from me. I don't think I would like find that one interesting. Like obviously it's Shane Dawson. Obviously I'm going to. But yeah, I don't think it would interest me that much as like the Jeffree Star one would. But I'm hooked. It's just so like what the hell kind of thing. So quickly off camera, um I've stuck my lashes on. Um I use the girls of attitude fantasy ones in Princess which are from Primark and they're three pounds. So for foundation today, I'm gonna to be trying the Revolution Conceal and Divine Full Coverage Foundation. I did actually literally get this like a month ago and I was gonna do a first impressions video, but obviously I've left it too late and I just don't really see the point in it. So yeah, I'm just gonna use it in this and kind of do like a first impressions in this. So I got this in the shade 10.5 and um, like fingers crossed this is gonna match me so it's got like the little applicator like the um concealer has um okay i didn't actually put as much product on my face as i thought it would i'm gonna blend this in with a sponge rather than a brush and see how that works oh so it is definitely full coverage which i like especially for a going out foundation um, the only thing is, like, you don't actually get as much product. Um, my room's getting a bit dark now because I don't have the light coming from that side. So I'm really sorry if there's shadows on this side. I might actually switch these lights on. I'm actually going to use my Tarte Shape Tape today because I do want a full coverage under eye. So yeah, very similar, just more expensive. You see um, the picture, you know, Tammy, Ham Tammy Hembrow, so her ex. My throat ex-boyfriend friend today whatever you want to call him did you see he posted a picture with a new girlfriend on instagram and he was like just keeping it real or something like that like yeah i think it's too soon like they did have kids together they were engaged i'm pretty sure they were engaged correct me if i'm wrong but i'm pretty sure they were engaged they did have two kids together so yeah i think it's been probably been like three four months and he did seem like really like upset over it like he did a video in bali and everything like saying that she randomly broke up with him she broke up with him so yeah like she just he like he said in his video that she just randomly broke up with him and obviously there was like speculation that she cheated and stuff 
but who knows if that's true. I think if he broke up with her, or like if she had posted that picture, then like with a boy, then I'd kind of be like, well, because they kind of looked like they were kind of talking when they were still together and kind of thing. But obviously she broke up with him, so I mean like, good. Like he's moving on and stuff. Like I'm like, it's good if he's happy and stuff, but yeah i do think it is a little bit too soon how cute is this it's like an absolute one but i'm trying to smell enough out of it um yeah i took these from work at my old pub they just had them in a box so i just stole two because i'll be like they'll be useful for drinking um at uni from drinking from at uni and yeah i actually don't even use <laughs> great i actually don't even use cups anymore i literally just use these all the time i'm gonna start like planning my videos for the week. I really want to do a QA. I've never done one before. I've done like a get to know me tag, which isn't a QA. Um, but I just don't feel like anyone wants any questions. And like I don't wanna put it like put a thing like on YouTube or Instagram. Instagram. Because I don't feel like many people actually I don't think anyone from YouTube actually follows me on Instagram. I think my QA is gonna have to like wait. Maybe in future years to come. And I'm gonna use a Kylie Bible palette. Because I was going through my drawers the other day and I was like, oh my god, I used to love the highlights in this palette so, so much. These two, the first two, obviously I can't really use these two, these are far too dark for me. So yeah, I'm going to give these a go again and see if I still am obsessed. Because I literally used to be obsessed, I literally just used to mix them. And yeah, let's put this on my cheeks and see how it goes. Oh my gosh, yes. I'm going to do my lips quickly. So... I can go to the toilet. So I'm using my favourite duo, which is Strip Down by MAC. So I'm just going to line my lips with this. And then Girlfriend, I don't even know why I even had to read that. I didn't. Girlfriend by Huda Beauty. Guys, I know Huda Beauty is expensive, but if you have not tried one of their lipsticks, on one of her lipsticks, honestly try it because they're literally one of my favourite formulas. If anyone knows anything like the same as Huda Beauty, they're cheaper, please tell me because I would love, love, love to know. Okay, so I'm going to wrap this video up here because I'm bursting for the toilet um i really hope you enjoyed this video if you did make sure you give a thumbs up comment down below and i'll see you in my next video bye